Okay, let's get started. This is such a gorgeous color that I had to to do a tutorial on it. Let me zoom in so you can focus on my face. Okay, this is um, Maybelline's Antique Jade. I got it from Target. And it is a gorgeous color. I'll show how you can see it real good. I don't know my lighting, but it's a pretty okay, color. Okay, we're going to go ahead and get um, started. I've already put um, a base on my eyelid, and it was Max um, Paint Pot and Groundwork. And I am going to use um, Max Foley, and I'm just going to put it um, in my crease and above my crease with Sonia Kashuk's Fluffy Blending Brush, okay? This weekend, me and my husband went to see um, Robert De Niro's new movie, uh, Killer Elite. It was pretty good, action-packed. Yeah, it was pretty good. Y'all seen that? Did y'all see Colombiana? I think her name is Zoe Saldana. I think that's her name. Probably messing that name up. That was a pretty good movie, too. And The Help. Okay, that's it. Gonna move on to this gorgeous Maybelline green color. And I'm just gonna use Max, I think it's 239 flat shader brush. Mm -hmm. And I'm just gonna pack that all over my eyelid, okay? And it's gonna take a minute because I'm gonna pack it real good on there. And you're just gonna um, just keep packing it on. Make sure you get your lash line real good. This is such a gorgeous color. I saw this color in a, in a pair of shoes at Charlotte Russe. You're going to take that color up um, a little bit above the crease um, into that Foley color. Just a little bit above the crease. I know it seems like I'm packing a lot, but I just want that green to really pop. <laughs> okay. And then we're going to blend out that harsh line. This is a Sonia Kashuk brush, and it looks like that. It's kind of like a dome shape. I'm not sure what kind of brush this is, but I'm just going to kind of smooth out that harsh green line, okay? And it's just a clean, clean brush. And you can do this with any brush, actually. Okay, and to help make sure that that um, green line is blended really well, I'm going to use my um, favorite blending color, which is Max Texture. And it's almost like my skin tone color. And I am going to use um, Max 224 brush. Just going to go over that um, where that uh, green line is. Just like that. Just to make sure it transitions well, blends well. Easy as that. <laughs> okay, I'm going to take another one of Max. Um, colors and it's MAC uh, brown down and I am going to use MAC's 222 brush 
and I'm just going to do the outer one third and in the crease just to give this color some definition. This eyeshadow some definition. Go in and circle emotions on the outer portion of my lid like that. Add some more product to the brush and go up in the crease. just like that. <laughs> now I'm going to take my highlight color and that is um, Max uh, Soft Brown and I'm going to take a small um, crown brush and it's the C152 medium chiseled fluff brush. That's all that is. Very flat brush. And I'm just going to apply this highlight under the arches of my eyebrows. And then I'm going to take a fluffy, another clean fluffy brush and just kind of blend, blend that in. And I don't know, this is another MAC brush. I think this is a 217 brush. Just to soften that highlight color up. Now I'm going to use my liquid eyeliner and this is L'Oreal Linear Tints in black. I think it's called Carbon Black. Move the mirror closer. Hmm. I wore this color Friday, and um, but I didn't do a makeup tutorial, and I love the way that the color pops. So I said. Today, I will do a tutorial with this color. I'm getting ready for church now. And I just line my top lid. And I do the outer one third a little bit thicker than the rest of the um, eyeliner on the lid. And okay. Moving on, my lips are so dry today. I should have put some moisturizer on before I uh, <laughs> turned the camera on. Hi, huh, y'all. Y'all stop talking about me. I heard y'all say ashy lips. Okay, now I'm going to move on to the Clinique's um, eyelash primer. I'm going to put that on my eyelid. While I'm waiting for that to dry, I'm going to line my um, waterline with the Urban K 24-7 um, eyeliner. And this is in zero, which is black. Did I ask you if y'all saw the help? The help was so good. That was good. Funny too, wasn't it, y'all? If y'all seen it. If not, it is worth going to see. So is Columbiana, and so is the other one that I talked about. Okay, now I'm going to add a little bit of that same um, green eyeshadow to the outer mm, one third of my eyelid on the bottom. And I'm going to use um, another one of crown brushes, and it's the C123 Mini Chisel Brush. It's just another very tiny. Um, shader brush and I'm just gonna dip my brush just in there like that to get it on the tip like that and see just get it on the tip and then I'm going to place it on the outer one third kind of smudge it a little bit as I place it on there hmm <laughs> 
and this is where I left off with this idol, eyelid. So now I'm going to add some mascara to both eyelids. And this is um, Max False Lashes in uh, black. Love this. Just going to put that on my eyelashes. I went to the mall with my girlfriend yesterday. They had some new MAC products um, that uh, came out. So we went to the Macy's MAC counter. And I didn't buy one thing. Can you believe that? Not one thing. I saw some pretty colors, but nothing that really jumped out at, at me. Right now, I'm really trying to um, use the products that I already have um, in my makeup case. Like I said, none of the there were some gorgeous eyeshadows, but most of which I have something similar. So I said I'll pass. <laughs> okay, now I'm going to move on to my foundation and I am using Maybelline's Dream Matte Mousse in Cocoa Dark. That's what it looks like and I'm just going to use my MAC um, 165 brush. It's like a dome, you can't tell, but it's like a dome brush. Just going to put that all over my face. I'm constantly moving the mirror. I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> this is such a light foundation, and I just love this foundation. As a mousse consistency. I'm just tapping it in there. <laughs> a lot of product doesn't transfer onto this brush. That's why I have to do it a lot of times. <laughs> this is probably not the brush I should be using with this, but I do. <laughs> Make sure you get your hairline. my lips. I went running today. In the rain. I did about three miles today. I like to go running before um, church. Normally my husband goes with me, but today he's um, sleeping in. <laughs> Hard working man, I thought he's tired. Okay. okay, for my cheeks, I'm just gonna use a little bit of shimmer. And it's um mineralized skin finish in brunette by MAC. I'm just gonna take my Coastal Sense fan brush and just um dab a little bit of it on. Just give it a little shimmer. Hmm, just like that. I really can't see it in my camera. <laughs> and for these dry lips of mine, <laughs> I'm going to use, um, I got this from Jordana. I think I got this from Kmart. I don't know what the color is. 
E123. 110E123. But that's what it looked like. Just a pinky color, y'all. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put that on my lips. Just to give it a little, little color. My lips are saying, thank you. I don't know why I didn't put any moisturizer on before I turn the camera on. <laughs> now, y'all. Okay. So, this is the finished look. Hope y'all like. I think that's a gorgeous green. Let me, uh, fix it. Uh-oh, I'm knocking over stuff. This is how I keep my stuff, y'all. <laughs> the brushes that I pretty much use the same brushes all the time. Once in a while, I'll change up. But anyway, let me um, zoom out. So as y'all can see. Mm. And this is the finished look. You like? I like. I'll show some pictures at the end. Thank you so much for watching. You all have an absolute wonderful day wherever you are in the world. Bye-bye.